Hey guys, so I know the lighting's not the best here. I procrastinated all day and now the sun is already down. I wanted to film like by my festive little baby Christmas tree. So um, you don't really need to see, I mean, you need to see for this video, but I think the lighting is okay. If it's totally bad, I'm just gonna scrap it. Recently reordered Glossy Box, um, which I received like three free ones back when Glossy Box came to the United, I don't know, a year and a half ago. I'm, I don't really, I have a bad concept of time. So, um, you know, I still think I graduated college like a year ago when it was really like six or seven years ago. So that's another story. But um, I got Glossy Box like whenever they offered to send it to me, they sent me like three boxes, three months worth of boxes. And I really liked it. Um, the price point is a little bit higher than the Birch Box or Ipsy is what the new one's called. Um, I've tried Birch Box and I, you know, you'd go through months where I like really liked it and then I'd have months where I really hated it. So I stopped doing Birch Box. Um, Ipsy was called My Glam, I think. Glam Box? Glam Bag? Glam Bag? I don't remember, but that's what it was called. It's Michelle Fan's um, service. And uh, I kind of, I watched some videos about what people have been getting in those recently. So I thought about signing up for that. I was like, maybe I'll give that a try again. Uh, and I went to go do that and they put me on a waiting list, which I did not like. Maybe the demand is higher than the supply, but I just kind of think that that's not the case. Um, so I was on it for like a little while and then I decided to get a year subscription of Glossy Box. They're not paying me. They don't know I make, I mean, I don't know if they know I make YouTube videos, but I signed up because they were offering a free holiday box um, and then the year subscription, which they're usually like $21 a box. I think it was like 18 a box. So you got a few dollars off. Um, it took a really long time for me to get my December box and I went online to contact them about it and then I ruined the surprise and saw everything that was going to be in the box, which was kind of a bummer. But that being said, I was just going to do a quick little overview of what you got in this glossy box. Let me know if you guys want to see these videos or you don't. I kind of like to watch them, but let me know what you think. So this is better. At least you got to see my little Christmas tree, even though it's really dark in there. That was a silly idea. So as I was saying, uh, you get a card that says, and I'm not gonna, you know, I'm sure you guys are familiar with these things, but, um, I think that this is a new addition. I mean, I think it used to be just a card that showed you, told you what everything was and the prices, but this now like shows which products are which and it's in color. So that's a, a nice little uh, touch and it gives you tips on how to use them if you didn't know. So the first product I got um, is, an, and there's two products that I guess are like Glossy Box branded products, I would say. Um, so the first one is this pink um, nail polish, which is called Pink Outside the Glossy Box. And it has, I think that this is just the wrapper on the outside, but it has, um, I guess you could take it off or leave it on. It has this Glossy Box um, label on it. So this might be another color. I have not tried this yet, and I'm kind of curious to see if it's opaque or sheer polish. If this is opaque, this will be very, very pretty. If it is not opaque, um, I'm hoping it's the color of all time by Essie is uh, Fiji, which is this white pink color. And I've gotten this in the salon before, well, even though I own it. Um, but sometimes it's pinker than the one that I have. Mine's super white. So if you see them next to each other, you could see that this um, pink outside the glossy box is a lot pinker. But if this is an opaque color, this is going to be amazing. So I'm, I'm really excited to try that. It was a nice touch and it's a full size, uh, nail polish, which retails for like nine fifty. I think that they say that those go for these days. The next product that I got is by Juice Beauty. And I feel like I've seen these before. I don't think I've ever tried them, but I've seen these before in birch boxes in maybe glossy box, maybe the other one. I don't know. I feel like I've had this brand so many times. It's by Juice Beauty. I'm not going to knock it until I try it, but I'm just kind of bored with this brand. Um, it says it's the Green Apple Age Defy Moisturizer, and it says it reduces the appearance of wrinkles and has firming peptides in it. I'm at the age, well, I think I'm past the age where I need to start thinking about, like, aging 
creams, the, the preventative ones. So I need to start using something. I got some samples from Sephora the other day. So I will try this out. My skin has been a little bit sensitive. So then you get a blush by Cryolan and it is made exclusively for Glossy Box as well. Uh, the color is called Glossy Rosewood and it's made in Germany. I don't think I've tried Cryolan products before. I've seen them before. Uh, I might have gotten one in a glossy box. I feel like they're always in glossy box, but this is the color. It's a pretty pink, uh, like a darker pink, so it's really nice. Okay, never mind. Um, it just fell completely out of the tin. Like, tin, blush, nothing is on the... This is like the, the blush. I'm surprised that this just didn't break all over my floor. But, um... Yeah, this, uh, the pan is still in there, so I'm just going to slip it back in, but this is kind of annoying because it just, like, is right here. So, um, that's interesting. Uh, I don't know about that. The container itself is plastic. Uh, it's, I guess, good for traveling because it's very small. Um... It's a nice color. It says it's a universal color, and I would agree with that. Maybe if you have darker skin tone, it wouldn't show up as much. I used this yesterday, and it was pretty, but I just don't like that it completely pops out like that. So, let's move on to the next thing. The next thing is by Knip or Knip, or I'm not sure, K-N-E-I-P-P. -P. It's another... German brand and then this is an herbal bath um it says a popular German brand I have never heard of it but it's um a lavender balancing bath so it says it helps combat fatigue with natural essential oils I love lavender I really wish this wasn't for the bath um because I don't take baths that often it smells heavenly it smells like lavender, so if you don't like lavender, you won't like this, but this smells like lavender oil. I wish it was just lavender oil, because then I would put it like on my pillow, um, or I'd rub it in moisturizer or stuff like that. So uh, it says you can get one to two baths out of this, so um, if I ever do, and I will take a bath with this, but I'll probably just use the whole bottle because I just don't take baths often. But this is nice. It smells really, really good. Product I actually used today, and it's by this company called 12 Benefits. It's an instant ha healthy hair treatment. Um, this kind of reminds me of It's a 10, like the hair product It's a 10, which is a spray-on leave-in uh, treatment that you spray on your... You can spray it on your, your dry hair, but you typically spray it on your wet hair, and it does 10 things. This does 12, so they were they're trying to two up um, It's a 10. So what it says it does is uh, seals, colors, smooths, repairs, improves texture and manageability, prevents split ends, moisturizes, strengthens, protects from chlorine, wind, and sun, prevents from flat iron damage, adds shine and softness, and protects from blow drying, and it's also anti-aging formula. I sprayed this on my hair today. I actually washed my hair today. I so far really like this when I repurchased this. Um, Maybe, I mean, I have a lot of other things to go through, and it says what the instructions say, mist hair liberally before blow drying or swimming, do not rinse. So that's what I did. I just kind of sprayed it all over my whole entire head before I blow dried my hair today. And um, yeah, like it's super shiny. I did straighten my hair, and I don't normally use like a heat protectant, which I know that I should. Um, so it's really nice to have this, and we will be using this up. So. That is everything in my glossy box. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you want to see one of these every month because like I said, I got a 12-month subscription and um, also signing up, I got the holiday box, which I haven't received yet, but um, that one looks really exciting. I've already seen what's in there. So thanks for watching. I'll see you guys soon. Bye.